as a noise and then she cried and then she redirected it towards me. Oh, oh, oh. Yes, that's what was in there. That's what you were barking at. It's really important that the first thing this dog learns is how to get out of my space when I ask for it. She doesn't get to have a barking fit and then have access to the baby. She can smell at a distance. I want to make sure that the first thing she learns is how to move away from me or follow me if I need her to. But if I'm holding the baby to move away from me when I ask, that is the most critical thing. And yes, your dog can learn how to be pet, but not get to invade the baby's space all at the same time with the baby right there. Even a young puppy can do it, let alone a six month old. I'm just waiting to see if she decides to bug the baby. Look at that. She sniffed at a distance, gets a piece of food. This dog never barked at the baby again really confirming my uh, my suspicion that she is just <laughs> suspicious and her reactivity, is, there's is not there? much behind it. There could be very easily within a few months, but luckily not yet. I'm handling people walking by similarly to how I handled the baby a few days prior. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hi. Well, 
Good looking dog. <laughs> Thanks. Training dog, huh? Yes. Yep. A little barking you can tell your people. Now we're doing it with the gardeners. She's e-collar trained at this point. Good. Now I'm able to click to her, almost like a clicker, um, by doing it with my mouth like you would to a horse. You can also kiss to your dog. Sometimes that works too. It's a great interrupter for food. Here I do it because the noise gets really loud and she stays looking at me. There are two okay. times where she gets a little intense. I can see stiffness in the body. I use low-level e-collar to help her disengage and she still gets food. Good. Good. The change I saw here is she kind of leaned Good. forward, so low e-collar. Good. Place. Place. A little jumpy. Good girl. Little, so we give a little distance, give an anchor makes her feel better. Good girl, excellent. Here I am desensitizing her to the doorbell and knocking. When she looks away or doesn't react, I'm clicking and tossing food to her. If she was to react, I would use e-collar and then I would do some let's go work with her to calm her down and I would repeat that until we would get to this stage. Just a minute. Good, good girl. Just a minute. Hey, how's it going? Pretty good, how are you? Good. Would you come in right there, uh, shut the door behind you? Wait, just a second. Sure. All right, just come right on up to the threshold. Good girl. All right, come on, walk right on by her. Good. Good, come on up to me. I'm gonna release her to say hi. Do you mind just sitting in the chair? Sure. I'm just kind of let her come to you. Lyric break. Go ahead hi. and say hi to her. No. She's like, I care about food. Good girl. Nice job. Go ahead and stop. So, tap a couple pieces of food. Oh. But yeah, ex exactly like that. You can kiss to her, or I like clicking. Um, but either, good. Either way, it's totally fine. So, that, she's just wondering what it is. I mean, she's not nervous, but it doesn't matter. You're kind of building this relationship that just pay attention to me. And so, even looking at the kid, makes good. She's expecting food. <laughs> so go ahead and give her a piece of food. Oh. Look, look, she's like, look, I dealt with that really well. Give me my payment. Thank you. <laughs> and so anyway, when she's actually looking at something, just good. Good job. Yeah. Or just kissing to her mm -hmm. is a really good redirect for her. It's what I do when packages are dropped off and oh. people come to the door as well. I don't say lyric or no or good or any of that. I make some sort of noise to get her attention and toss food at her basically, okay. <laughs> which works, which has been working really nicely. And you can do the same thing in this situation, especially if you were closer to the kids area. Like if you were doing, if we were doing one of those benches, we might constantly be clicking food, clicking food, or kissing to her food, and just reinforcing that stay here, look at children, get food. Stay here, look at children, get food. And just really regularly keeping that up for her. Yeah, she's doing really well.